Morning. Morning. So we're on the road to the NEC. We're nearly there. Well, yeah, not too far away. Yeah. So a bit of traffic on the M1, uh, but on the uh, M42, 842 now, and uh, it's cleared up nicely. So we should be there in about hopefully 40 minutes. Yeah. And this is the first time we've been to the NEC since last year. And last year we went, we bought a van. So this will be cheaper. Much cheaper. Although we have got the credit card, but not to buy a van. Um, yeah, so we're going to go look at the van because although we bought it last year, we haven't actually seen one since then. So we, the first time we saw it was last year. We bought it that day or paid the deposit. Paid the deposit, yeah. Everybody said year and a half, maybe longer. It's actually here at the dealers less than a year after we bought yeah. it. Yeah, in fact, we could have had it already. Yeah. Um, but we wanted a new plates. Yeah, we wanted the new plates on them. Having that and all been fitted, so. Yeah. Um, yeah, but we literally haven't seen it since the day we put the deposit on. So excited! So yeah. we'll actually be in having a route round today. Yeah. Get an idea of what we need to do, and then yeah. we're also going to have a look around at the vans and stuff. But the main thing is security. Yeah, we're going to see if there's any distributors or displays of security because new van, we need to get some stuff on it, especially yeah. if we're going to travel. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. So visible deterrent and then some sort of tracker. Yeah. Um, so just have a little look around that type of stuff and then we're going to look around at you know, different heating systems and sort of like uh, some, some off-grid stuff I think, some yeah. more off-grid stuff because we've got a couple of ledge batteries, good solar, um, so yeah I'm interested in looking at a lot more stuff that we can run off the solar or anything that's sort of eco or that's what I'm interested in aren't I? Yeah. So we'll and a uh, diesel heaters. Yeah, possibly a diesel heater. So get a new van, fit a new heating system. But anyway, we'll catch up later and we'll let you see what we see. Yeah. Bye. Hi, we're Nikki and Billy, and this is our channel. So it's all about our little adventures in our van, whether that's hiking mountains, biking, socialising, eating, drinking, or just us. So if you want to follow us, just subscribe and see what we get up to. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> uh, the pictures don't do it justice, do they? You know, the, the, the pictures. It's much better in real life. Uh, you have to so, speak up. Yeah, much better in real life. What do you think? I think it's bloody ace. <laughs> yeah, it's so much better, isn't it? Doing that, can you just pack it up for us a little yeah. bit? We, we bought this van from Not the show this one, last yeah. year. Did you? Yeah. yeah. We haven't, we haven't seen it. one since we saw one last year. So we came, saw it, bought it that day, put a deposit. Pick it up next month, we haven't seen one since. Pick it up on about the 3rd of March, and this is the first time, obviously. That's a weird. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that one back though, considering what they said. They were saying year and a half to two years last year, weren't they? Yeah. So, so we just thought the first van we're going to look at today. Come on, see, remind ourselves what we've bought. Yeah. Yeah, basically. Yeah. <laughs> you too, mate. We'll look round. I've had to look round. It's absolutely fantastic. Exactly the same as I remember it. Uh, it's, in fact, the pictures don't do it justice, do they? No. Obviously, we've lost a bit of living space, but not as much as I was feeling from the pictures. Now we're actually in it. Now we're actually sat in it. Um, I don't feel like we've lost as much living space. I feel like we're, we're fine. But... Definitely, definitely want to look at getting that art table adjusted because obviously ours doesn't have the drop down, does it? And then that just gives us that bit of extra space when we're on long journeys. But it's absolutely fantastic. It's everything I thought it was. It's perfect. It's brilliant. And I'm so excited. Yeah. We don't have the window. Oh yeah, we that do have the hook. That was an extra, the window. You know that? No, we don't have the, the window, but we do have the hook. Do you remember the, that yeah. review was saying it didn't have a hook? So we have got absolutely everything. Bigger toilet, more knee room. Yeah, and the fridge. Yeah, absolutely everything in here. It's fabulous. Yeah, and it is, yeah, massive. Yeah, I'm so excited. Can't wait now. It's yeah. good as you remember then. Oh God, yeah, absolutely. Oh yeah, that little seat pad. Yeah. So when you're getting up onto the bed, the bed's huge, the bed's really comfy. Loads and loads of storage. 
There is a lot of storage in yeah. there. His and her sides. But now I'm just rooting, you know, looking where I'm going to put everything. Loads of drawers. How are we going to be identifying as M and B drawers? Yeah, bottles and things in there. That'll probably be like living stuff, won't it? to stop you rolling out of bed. Do you remember we were laughing? Yeah, the bar. So that's, to, that's, to, that's the safety bar for if you've got children. But there'll be no children in our bed. Try the tray then. Does it lock in? Oh, it's just fingertip. Fingertip, darling. It's it. Yeah. Massive. So much space. So that's your side. That's my side. Well, isn't that? The stuff in. So happy? Oh, absolutely. Excited? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Just um, got me right back on track this, remembering how good it is. Nikki exchanging fractured foot stories because that's what she does all the time, fractures her feet or ankles. <laughs> Never! 
could have come and bought a houseboat. And then it doesn't matter what the river swell does. Future proofing. I think it's pretty expensive though. Very excited with you before to see him. What? What's your best adventure walk? What's my best adventure walk? What a great question. I love going to my ridge. And I say my ridge, it belongs to another person, but um, there's a ridge where I live where I can go and watch golden eagles and white-tailed eagles sitting. And the beauty about this ridge is I'm so high up, I get to look down on these golden eagles and the white-tails. A lot of people, when they see eagles, the eagles are high up in their spec. But I'm lucky enough to get a vantage point, and it's pretty special for me. That's where I do most of my eagle filming, and I get to look down on them, and they're majestic. Hiya, Mike. Just seen the perfect thing. Get rid of your caravan. I've found the perfect one for you. Here it is, look. <laughs> it's got you written all over it, look. <laughs> Let's show him. <laughs> yeah, perfect. We can just see you climbing into this one. <laughs> So it's 5.5, yeah. 82 grand. This is the demonstration one, it's 82 grand. It's got pop top as well. Oh yeah, it's got pop top. Yeah, garage isn't big enough for us, for our bikes. Have you seen this weird mattress? I'm just not convinced. Look. Yeah. But I mean, if you've got the pop top. German engineering, it'll work. Yeah, I know, I know. Oh, no. But I think there's much more space in our van. Oh, my our God. Our van's bigger. And there's much more space for bikes, isn't there? And yeah. we're saving, what? 30 grand. 30 grand? That's oh. part of 30 grand. Yeah. So, yeah. we'll not be getting one of them ever, will we? No. That one's got the bumps. That looks quite plush. It's got a decent power system in oh, there, yeah. doesn't it? But again, no, not so much garage. I think room. there's more garage space than ours, isn't it? This will be quite top end. You can tell by yeah. that. Yeah. Well, yeah, but so the nice mattress and the finish. Very small cupboards. What size? Them the teeny. Yeah. I bet it's that. Yeah. It's nice. But again, you know, see what price is there. Yeah. yeah. That's ninety-three for that model. Yeah. bum on that toilet seat there. I mean, it is lovely. It's it's quite very nice. Uh, like corner seats are funny little thing, isn't it? Different. Yeah. Well, that's your bed, isn't it? You've got loads. Actually, you've got loads of things down here. That's how you get into your garage. These are quite teeny weeny though. You can barely get anything in there. Uh, microwave. Oh, uh, hob. Electric hob. I mean, the finish is nice. It's got a nice finish. Um, and it's got one of them rolly doors, look. The sink's about that big. You wouldn't even clean your teeth without getting it all over. And you won't get your bum on that loose seat. What are you trying to say? I've got fat <laughs> arse. You're saying I've got a big arse? Mind you, there's a good vent. You might need that. Um, I mean, <laughs> well, it's very, it's, I mean it is well. a nice finish, isn't it? Which is why it's so expensive. Yeah, it is a nice finish, but... But you're looking at nearly 100 grand for this. It's nowhere near the same storage, is it? Nah. I mean, it's plush. It's a nice plush finish, but... Yeah. I'll peep in the back of the bunk You don't have beds, you have your bunks. I'd end up on the top one. Which wouldn't be great when you're drunk, would it? Uh-huh. Careful in case it's uh, 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 So that must be storage, you think? Must or? be. I don't know, I don't get into it. How'd you get into it? I don't know, but let's not do it, eh? Dumped. The top one's locked, isn't it? We've done it. It's pulled. Leave it. Oh, oh no, it's just the back way in, though. Oh, there's your back way Oh, that is tight. Again, tiny sink, yeah. so I'll get mess. That's I think I'll get me bum on that one. Yeah, that's uh, no missing in the dark. <laughs> yeah, so this is your back way in. I thought it was a cupboard. Mad. I don't know why you'd leave it back way in. 
Because right. it's a fire escape, isn't it? Yeah. It's alright if you don't get on, you can have separate beds. Yeah. Yeah. So, so who would like one of these then? Stephen Liz. Stephen Liz. You could yeah. see him in this, couldn't you? I should we show it around then, yeah, shall we? I think we um, I don't know if we could afford to buy it for Cactus. Them. If we won the lottery, we couldn't afford to buy it for him, could we? Four before. It is nice. They'd love this. 142, 500. They'd love that. They would. But I wonder what the back's like. So it's got the bikes on the back, so. Yeah. It's high, isn't it? It's high. Yeah. Well, They'd got, love this. They've got loads it. of storage in the back as well. Yeah. I think it would have. Well, it's not going to be wasted. Yeah. Yeah. That, that must be. Um, Nice little ceiling as well. Right. It comes in a different colour. Proper off road, isn't it? Nuts. So this one's 128. This is nearly 20 grand cheaper than the other one. So it's tiny. It's, a, well, it's the same, I think. Is it the same? No, no, it's the same size. It's got the same garage in. Um, so yeah, garage is really well made, but yes. Yeah. So, do you reckon this comes down then? Oh, do you that's reckon? what I think. I could be wrong, but that's what I think. No, it's bolted in. You've got to lift it on. I reckon. And you're reversing cameras underneath there, so it doesn't get yeah. obscured by the bikes like on the old one. Finish, isn't it? <laughs> Loads of storage in the door, that's a good idea, isn't it? Yeah, that looks storage pink. in the doors. Is that pink? Yeah, I think so. Expensive. So the fridge is smaller, it's smaller. isn't it? Yeah. And there's actually less space to be fair. It must be shorter. Let's see. What size is it? Can't see it, but glasses. Can you see how long it is? No. So we just looked at the locks at Rafe, haven't we? Yeah. And when you look online, actually, it looks like a deal at the show. You've got to be careful and check, haven't you? Yeah. Because you can actually get those locks 20, 30 quid cheaper online. And they look like the same Rafe 2 locks from uh, whatever that company was called. Yeah. So but at least we got uh, uh, Milenko. Yeah, Milenko. Yeah, but at least you get to see everything demonstrated. Yeah, yeah. If you want it there and then, you can get it there and then. And I think the uh, steering wheel lock was the same price. Yeah, so we might get one of those, but yeah. I'm not I think sure we'd one, get the wheel one. Wheel one was, I think we can get that cheaper. Oh, that's quite posh, isn't it? Yeah. There's some so, velvet interiors going on. Yeah, should we have a look at these vans then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of these sprinter things, isn't there? Yeah. Like the big off roady ones. Them to a tea, I it? can't believe that up there. <laughs> Again, it's quite plush, but it says they're functional, but they're not. They're beautiful and they're flash, but they're not actually. Well, they're functional maybe for overland and stuff, but they're not functional inside, if you know what I mean. Look a bit too flash. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, really? oh, so this is your new Rebecca. So yeah, they're so posh. Um, so that's your double bed at the back. Yeah. The table's going there, but again, yeah, yeah. Just not sure. Really plush, aren't they? They're, they are fabulously plush vehicles. 
Let's have a look around this side. Uh, not a lot of daylight in this one, actually, interestingly. There's no side windows. No. We don't have any windows. Yeah, it would be dark, wouldn't it? Yeah. You'd have to have your lights on all the time in this one, wouldn't you? So we look around the side. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's posh. Um, Proper posh. Little shelf at the top as well. Yeah. Little drinks fridge as well. <laughs> yeah, fridge. yeah. I mean, it's beautiful. So it looks nice as well. Yeah, it's, it's a really nice. nice bathroom. Out of all the plush ones we've seen, this is the best. Yeah. Now, nice. the upmarket ones, this is definitely, if you want a posh van. Um, it's, on, it's not on a Ducato, is it? Or? No, it's a Roberta. I think I don't know. Is it a Sprinter? No, no, it's not, it's not. It's an Opal or something. Oh, is it an Opal? I don't know. I don't know. I've just got sucked in by the finish. A little shelf here as well. Yeah. Cupboards. But again, I think again the, more it, storage in the one we've got. But ours is practical, these are. These are just nice posh vans. That's massive. It is massive. <laughs> so, a lot more plush vans this year, isn't there? Oh my god, yeah, there's a massive bump up in the, um, the plush vans market. But a lot of them are like sort of like adventure vehicles or functional vehicles. And maybe they are, but they're not functional to use for sort of like outdoorsy people. They might be functional for, you know, getting around and they all look bloody good. And the interiors, they've, they've just gone so upmarket this year. But for us, there's not the space, not the storage. It's more about and twice, aesthetics. And to they're be... twice the price, if not three times the price. Yeah, so. yeah so to me, to me, I mean, there's some fantastic vans, beautiful, beautiful. But it's more about form than fun functionality. Yeah. Um, with all these adventure vehicles, and they are bloody. Get a house. Yeah, you could get, get a house. house, Jesus. Actually, you could so, get a holiday home in the Dales. Yeah, it's a cheap I mean, one. you know, I know we rave on and on and on about our farm. Well, we would do because it's ours. And to be fair, we ain't in the market to spend 150 grand anyway. But I still can't thinking how bloody good have the adventures are. Yeah. They're just all well, it's good. won the award at this show, hasn't it? Oh my so the God. expedition, not adventure, the, exp the adventures are the. Yeah, yeah, it's won an award this expedition year. Expedition 68 won an award. I can't help but think how brilliant they are. Value and, for money, good design. And it's a good finish. Yeah. Some of these really plush finishes are actually a little bit tacky. Um, but yeah, it's a great show. But yeah, whoa, has it gone up market this year with some of these vans? Yeah. Really has. Yeah, they must have boomed. Yep. Have a V-dub in it. This is this darling, it's so bright. This is completely opposite. You know, it's like, oh, the next one. You know, the red metal is so dark. Yeah. This is completely the opposite, isn't it? But you get, they build them so you can get them in different colours. Vehicle has displayed 118. It's not bad compared to some of the others, is no, it? No, I mean... But, no. what's missing? Oh, but it's the back. Go around the back. Oh, there's a bathroom at the back. I yeah, come and have a look. No, I've never seen them like this before. Have you? No. That's yeah, really unusual. See, I'm thinking there's no toilet, but yeah, it's here. Yeah, no, no, of course there is. It's here, look. And there's a, a separate shower. So you could have a poo with a view if you open your door. Poo with a view. Yeah. But again, what are you going to get in there? Well, so coming in. It's what I'm going to get outside. Come here, look at the shower. It's cool. This is cool, actually. It's like, get yourself round. Proper shower. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it? that is that is really cool. We didn't expect to find that back here. But again, it's 120 grand as displayed. It is nice having a poo with you. <laughs> it's an expensive poo with you, but it's great, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. My great fuel
half lift. How cool is that? <laughs> We're oh, not normally allowed to do one, are we? You can sit on the toilet properly. It's a proper lift. Proper shower. Nice bed This is flush. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. This is <laughs> stunning. Just stunning. Absolutely stunning. Full size cupboards. Nuts. Oh, another gorgeous bed. Another gorgeous bed. Bathroom's different. Oh, yeah. It's in the fridge freezer. Mad. These are just stunning. They are stunning. Got the aircon as well. Nice oh, shower. Telly in bed. Telly in bed. Bags. Come with little coffee machines. Yeah, this is, is beautiful. Oven? Is there an oven? Don't know. More now. Oh, microwave, yeah. They are fabulous. This is fabulous, oh. isn't it? Yeah. This, really is, is. this is a proper land cruiser, isn't it? Yeah. Sitting there, swigging your drinks on an evening, what do you think? Hey. It is absolutely stunning. I'm actually suckered in by this. <laughs> oh, you need to win the lottery and you need to learn to drive a huge bus. <laughs> now you've been inside, you're quite sold on the idea. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> they are nice inside, but unfortunately, I think I've had it on time walk, we can't be queuing again. Oh no! So, when I was in the garden, oh, you see, you see, 9,850. Yeah. I've got, um, a last I know has got one of them in her garden. They built it and got it all up and they barbecue in it and all sorts. Yeah. So they cook on that bit Just in the middle. Just a chimney, don't they? Yeah, you cook on that bit in the middle. Nice. Yeah. That's nice. Hello. Oh, there you go. Nice one here. Ah, this is one where the bed goes yeah. up. Yeah. Oh, look at this. How did they put it there? So get, this could actually end up being. So that's your. Yeah, you could get the bikes in there, couldn't you? Oh, God, could you? This was one of the first ones we looked at. Do you remember? Yeah, first ones we looked at. So how much is this? This is 92,995. Yeah, and it is, it's good. Was that on row price? What was that? It's this line. model. Yeah, so you can have that up. It's a toilet, right? Yeah, it's all right. That's not bad, look. Quite a nice little bathroom. Yeah, so that was you can either have that as a sofa then or as a bed car, you can feel a bit good. Get a bit cool, right up out of the It's got some decent electrics and stuff in it, but it's a, it's a lot of money, another off-roader that's expensive. 165 starting price. There must, there must be nearly a kilowatt on the roof. Yeah. All, the All that electrics in there is nuts, isn't it? It's expensive though, you'd expect a kilowatt, wouldn't you? We're back in our favourite section. Back in our favourite section, the auto trail section. Yeah. yeah. It's a lot busier now, isn't it? Back in our favourite section. So, we've been around everywhere, haven't we? We have been around. Oh, you need on top of me there. Did we find anything we liked for the price? No. We found stuff we liked, but we couldn't afford it. No. <laughs> so, there was nothing as good as that Expedition 68, nothing. was there? No. So, nothing at all. Valley for money, what a van. They're absolutely outstanding. Yeah. So here we are again, the Expedition 68. Our favourite, favourite van. Right, come on, let's go for our membership. Yeah, come on. Hiya. Hello. We're in the traffic and a little bit of rain going home. Yeah. So we've been to the show and we got the first thing that we wanted out of the way, which was to go see the van that we bought, that we haven't actually seen since we bought it. Yeah. So the result of that is, yes, we made the right decision. 
and yes we absolutely love that bar yeah, and great. the pictures I've been looking at lately don't do it justice so it's absolutely cracking and for the price oh you can't beat it you just can't beat it we've been in but well it feels like we've been in every single van in the whole of the show um mainly ones with garages we were looking yeah. at ones with garages not as big twice the price i mean the nearest things are like 30 grand more weren't they oh god yeah there was some nice stuff but 30 40 grand more and you still more. weren't getting any more garage in fact you were getting yeah. less garage you were getting more of a plush interior camper vans seem to have gone really up market on the interiors yeah. um, and some of the finishes are a little bit too much to be fair aren't they yeah. so who wants velvet and an <laughs> expedition van go to sahara with a velvet thing that'll work out well yeah. won't it? so there's loads of that though this year compared to last show isn't it lots yeah. and lots and lots of those big four-wheel drive off-road you know vans that you see youtube type of vans that yeah. go, go off around the world and stuff but the prices of them are up there with the bottom end of the plush big vans you see all over Europe yeah the Morellos or whatever they're called yeah we went we went in a Morello and the base price for that was Is it Morello or Morello I've got I don't know Morello 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 maybe you say Morello I say Morello <laughs> oh, yeah but the base price for that was under 200 grand which wasn't much different to the high-end sort of camper vans was it no crazy so, yeah. So the prices have gone up, and then point two, as we were going to look for security, we found some stuff. But when you look online, it's cheaper online. No. The, the, what we bought wasn't, but some of it was. So. So yeah, so we uh, we bought a wheel lock. So I bought a wheel lock for the steering wheel, but we didn't buy the wheel lock for the wheels because we could find them cheaper. Yeah, you could find that cheaper. Yeah, it's always worth checking if you're there because not everything's the bargain you think it is. So yeah, we're on the way home now. Maybe go for a pint. Oh no, we had wine Ooh. last night for Valentine's. Yeah, but that was Valentine's, only to go out. It's lads' night. You don't need to go out, it isn't lads' night. Lads' night is not Thursday, lads' night is Friday. Bet you I get to go for a pint. Right, <laughs> catch you later. He always gets to go for a pint. <laughs> Bye. 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 So that was a great day out and as you can see we even got to meet some famous YouTube faces. Uh, met some other people as well but I haven't got pictures of them so it was a really really interesting day seeing the vans, meeting people, seeing all the products and the upshot is we know we got the right van and we're ready to move on now which is retirement later in the year. So it's an exciting year for us, we've got loads of things planned and then we'll be off travelling. So if you want to see what we're doing just hit subscribe, if you want to see when we've got videos up hit the notification and if you enjoyed anything on this video give us a big thumbs up and we'll catch you on the road sometime have a great weekend bye